This is Smallsy Surgery. Hey everyone, I'm Paul. I'm Jake. Or Lainey. And Smallsy Surgery on Nova. This is a love that I don't want. It's gonna be okay. Hey, on the show tonight, they're back in the country, and it's about time because it, it, it almost didn't happen there at one stage. <laughs> That's true. Lainey in the building, everybody. <laughs> What's up, Australia? How are you both? Great to see you. I think we're super up, man. You up? Yeah, yeah, we're feeling super blessed. Very, very pleased. Yeah, mid tour. How's the show? I saw some craziness. Uh, where was it? Is it the Philippines that you were? Yeah. Doing. You went and served at a Jollibee's. Yeah. Oh yeah. They, baby. they fan. They love you at the. Either they love the Jollibee's or they love Laney. I'm not sure. I which think you, they love both. Both. Yeah. And so it was. Yeah. Uh, we combined forces and it was yes. mayhem. Yeah. For people who don't know, because I don't know if we have a Jollibee's here in Australia. It's uh, like the Filipino Burger King, but. They got a wild menu. Yeah. Yeah. And everyone gets super excited for it. And then they were more excited when you were behind the counter. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. 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 We've talked about doing like something like that at In N Out. Um, but we haven't made it happen yet. But we made it happen in oh, I can see yeah. I could see that happening uh, in and out. You yeah. just maybe next maybe next time. You know what I've always loved about the In N Out? Like if you were to do it, it's just how they make the fries, like with the, the potato slammer right there. Like they are boom, fresh. Mm-hmm. They are fresh. They're so yeah. good. Anyway. I'm so we're so hungry now. <laughs> I'm so hungry too. <laughs> yeah, we're going to Alfie's tonight. Uh, oh, are you? Yeah. Oh yeah, you'll love that. Um, yeah. How 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 are you, how are you, Paul? Actually, I'm there, doing great because there was. For... I want to ask yeah, for people yeah. who don't know, they, the tour had to be like rescheduled. Yeah, because you had a really unfortunate accident. Mm. Yeah, thanks for asking. Yeah, um, yeah, I was just headed home on my Vespa mm-hmm. and going through like an intersection, and someone didn't see me, and yeah. I honestly just woke up in an ambulance. I. I have no recollection, which is kind of good because I don't yeah. remember like the pain or anything like that. But um, yeah, I woke up and took me to the hospital and yeah, and did, I had to heal up for a second. Yeah, you did. You did have to. Was there much like rehab involved? Because it looked the. I, I mean, I, I I don't know exactly how seriously it was, but the photos I saw. Yeah. I was like, you were you were banged up. Yeah. You were yeah. banged up. I don't recommend getting hit by a car. No. Um, I- <laughs> I never really thought yeah. about it, but now, um, thank you for putting that out there. Great yeah. advice. Yeah, I think it's Great good advice. life advice. Yeah, you I'm know? done with bikes. So yeah, I'm not doing that oh, anymore. Completely off the Vespa. I'm done with it. Yeah, beautiful. Yeah, yeah I'm sure you're like <laughs> great. Thank great God, choice. The good choice. Yeah, yeah. I broke. Uh, it's like I broke my uh, the top of my shin, and oh. I tore all of the ligaments in my shoulder except for one. So my shoulder, I like. I need to go home after this and do some rehab. Some, like it's still some physio. Yeah. And uh, but my legs fine and I feel great. Like I'm, I mean, I'm so thankful, man. I'm really, face really is blessed. gorgeous. Yeah. Oh, that it never got touched. Thank yeah. the Lord. <laughs> I actually did break my face. You'd, oh yeah, there was it. You did look. Yeah. Bruised. <laughs> I had. I broke this. This. This part. Well, but, it's healed beautifully. Thank you. I don't know if you had any work done while it was under, while you were under, but hey, you may as well <laughs> while you're going through the pain. Yeah, that's true. I um, should have maybe thought about that. <laughs> how how is how has it been getting back on the road? Do we, like in getting back and doing the shows? And because I'm sure you were probably at a moment going, "Is this tour going to happen? What do we do?" Oh, yeah, it feels awesome to be back out here. I feel like we're playing the best shows of our lives. Yeah, and we've been talking about how this is the, definitely like the best show we've ever played in Australia. The yeah. fans are just like. Some extra love, some extra hype. So yeah. it's been really exciting. So, so we've done Melbourne already. We've done Adelaide. Yeah. Uh, Wednesday, uh, Sydney, and then Friday we've got in Brisbane. And this yep. is it for us. Like we started our world tour a year and a week ago. Yeah. In Oslo, Norway, and um, yeah, so we finished in in Brisbane. We yeah. did Perth right before we went to Asia. Which actually, the way that this all has worked out has actually been like. It's like the best thing that's ever happened. Yeah. Um, getting hit by a car. I just, I don't know, but everything's kind of working out for us the way it Did should. you have like an epiphany? You know how sometimes like when you, not that I, you, I don't know how, again, I want to choose my words carefully because I don't know how close you were, but when you're at death's door or you have a moment that is life changing, yeah, do, yeah. do you have like an, an epiphany where you're like, you know what? I am going to give my time to charity. I don't, I don't know. Like you just hear stories of people who have these life altering events, hmm. the, their perspective shifts, it changes. Yeah. Like just to be honest with you, I wasn't wearing a helmet, yeah. flip a coin. I like flew over the car so oh, I could have landed a different way and yeah. not been here. So, um, I am 
lucky enough that I walked away, but I'm hoping that a few things died inside of me that night. Yeah. Um, just some things that maybe I was holding on to, some bitterness, some unforgiveness, just some things that maybe I didn't like about myself. I, yeah. Not to get like super serious. No, I but, no, I no, I like it because like as an artist, you your songwriting and your music, it can come from a dark place yeah. and it can sometimes and again, I, I, I'm not. This is not me suggesting. It's more observation about bands and musicians in general. Is that that darkness can sometimes leach into every project, and it, it's a it's a loop. You can be on loop and never mm. really cleanse it out. That's right. And sometimes moments like this can happen, and you're like, you know what? I don't think I'm going to lo- spend another minute. That's right. Of what I have time here, worrying mm. about or loathing about or hating about or yeah. you know re like going over yeah, you're those exactly moments right. in my yeah. life. Cause... Yeah, my dad always my dad rides Harleys and he always tells me if you you know if something happens at the like to let go because yeah. people actually hurt themselves more by bracing for impact. Yeah. And um I just think like I I remember letting go right before and I also like metaphorically like want to let go of some stuff. Wow. Yeah. Well, I hope I hope that you sharing your story it lands with other people. Yeah. And I think that everything that we go through, uh, we have a chance to to give that that lesson mm. to people who may be listening. And even if it's just one, yeah. yeah. You can save one, right? Totally. What does that mean for the music now that you got the last shows? How, where are we? What are we taking time off? Are we getting back into the studio? What do we do at the end of the tour? Yeah, we're going to chill. You're going to chill? Yeah. I'm um, going to take some time. Good. Yeah. Good. Let's see what's up. And you're going to enjoy. Yeah. The last Lips couple of life. yeah, I like the sound of that because you can be on this sort of hamster wheel True. of yeah. like music album tour, music mm-hmm. album tour. Living's pretty inspiring. Yeah, so you just gotta go live. I lo- I this is a side of you boys that I'm so excited to. <laughs> it's like it it it's like a new evolved level. Do I you do you feel different? I do. Yeah. I, yeah. I, I, I'm. I kind of re- refuse to go through what I went through and be the same person. Yeah. That was kind of like my mantra so i like that and jake's been the best you know just yeah. there every step of the way so yeah 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 well the, the shows uh what do you got in store for the last couple of shows for people while they're here well look like like he said that they really have been just unbelievable like we played adelaide two nights ago yeah and i'll just tell two years ago we played adelaide it's like playing a nursing home bro it was like the worst i was <laughs> i think a lot of people who, steve he's yeah. from adelaide i was like you're gonna stay here yeah. you're not coming back and working <laughs> for us anymore <laughs> i was so pissed but we're like, we still went back and like i can't tell you how lit that show was yeah i was absolutely shocked i was yeah. so happy happy yeah. happy melbourne was insane we yeah we've played margaret court before we had to put the curtains over the seats you know we've played like yeah this time we just put the people in the seats that's it, right it was sorted out so that was yeah. lit and tomorrow's sold out in sydney so we've brought like our best too like we brought our a rig is what yeah. we call it so we've got like all of the production all the stuff. you and and for people who have not seen a laney show before <laughs> you guys always deliver on the production i've always tipped my hat to you, you to you boys you. it is a, at another level and it is always so uh it, it, it it's so thoughtful Thanks. in the way that it is all scoped out from track yeah. to track from beginning to end and sometimes it could be very easy just to show up and go let's just put some keys yeah. and a guitar and a drum and then just some some a strobe and, way and, and then, cheaper yeah 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 it saves me yeah, yeah yeah but it but you know what anyone who's been to one of your shows uh knows what one of your shows looks like that's right we're playing the long game yeah so yeah tomorrow we're we brought the the a rig the yeah. best of the best and so we'll see i think it'll be great um so you get home after the show taking a break uh what's the plans for christmas i feel like are you are you staying in la going back to new york so, what's yeah. the what are you doing yeah there? either stay in la or i have family in arkansas okay so one of those and just gifts and food and yeah our daughter's three so get to see her just light up it's oh, gonna yeah. be awesome can i can i call out the elephant in the room i feel like this might be the last time i see laney for a little while mm. i don't want to I only if the daughter that's three life altering moment yeah there could be time to invest in personal lives and just doing a bit of living mm. and not always working and I, I hope we, I hope I see you again. Thank I you. hope this is not the last time, in this professional sense, that yeah. I see you boys. Mm. 
Yeah. Thank you. Thank you for being here. Thank yes, you. Sir. Thanks Appreciate for always that. having us. Absolutely. You're a staple. You You're are a staple. For and us. you are always welcome. Thank you. And uh, I can't wait to have you back whenever Absolutely. that will be. Yes, sir. You're listening to the Smallsy Surgery Podcast. Hear more from Smallsy live weeknights from 8. Only on Nova.